Hi right, guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we're gonna to run through full day of eating, training day edition. Um, wanted to do one of these as food has increased this week. Um, so kind of wanted to just go through my current training day nutrition. It's currently 10 o'clock on the dot, as you can probably see, 10 o'clock. We just trained, um, got into the gym for six. Um, no food has been consumed yet. Um, train fasted, which probably some of you know who watch the videos, but train fasted. So, um, had my pre workout meal last night before bed, which is my last meal, and then train in the morning fasted. And the first meal goes in around now. Um, so post workout meal is currently 120 grams of cream of rice, big bowl of cream of rice, 30 grams of whey, um, 21 grams of raisins. That is the post workout meal. Um, health subs, always take my health supplements before I eat. So, got the full health stack from Supplement Needs, which is Astrag Flow, Heart Stack, Liver Stack. Um, then I've got the Train by JP, Digest Farmer Pro, um, Probiotic, um, Omega 3, 6, and 9s, Vitamin D, Tels Martin. I think that's it. I don't think I'm missing anything. I think that's it at the moment. Um, I am swapping over to the Train by JP um, Vital Support and the other one that's in the health stack. I can't remember, but I'm swapping over to that um, just because it's a, the, better the better panels than the supplement needs. And it's just what I need um, in terms of, because we got my bloods back um, the other day. So it's just in terms of what I need to kind of improve them, the um, Train by GP stack is better for me for that. So swapping over to that. I've been on swapping need stack now for the last three years, pretty much um, um, every day I've been taking that. So bloods are fine though. Bloods are all good, came back good. So we're happy to move on with this off season and start pushing. Um, like I said, food's been increased. So um, current macros, 320 on a training day, 325 gram protein. I th no, that's not right. 325? I think that's right. 225 grams of protein. Um, no. Yeah, so current macros at the moment for the training day, um, 325 grams of protein. 700 gram of carb, 65 grams of fat um, on a rest day, just to give you, um, just to let you know, 325 grams of protein, 550 grams of carbs, 65 grams of fat. Uh, we ran two high days this week. Um, so if you want to know what my high day consists of, go back to the channel, scroll through, you'll see a high day video there. Um, that's pretty much exactly the same as what I'm doing now. And um, what I have done for two days this week, I did one on Tuesday, which is my back and calves session, and then did one on Thursday, which is my leg session. Those are, if I have two high days, those are always the days that I put um, my high days on, um, just because it's the most output, it's the biggest sessions, it's body parts that I want to bring up the most. Um, so that's why I put them on there. So we'll run through today. I've got six meals today. Um, slightly less, it's funny how my food works. It's all the, at the end of the week, it's all the same macros, but the macros on the days are slightly different because I take, I basically take my, like I said at the start, I take my pre-workout meal and it goes the night before. So on rest days, the carbohydrates are slightly higher. And then on training days, the carbohydrates are slightly lower because today I won't have my pre-workout meal, um, which consists in the training day food, but I had it last night. So covering today, I don't have it tonight because I'm having a rest day tomorrow because I'm not training tomorrow. So it's still I still work it out at six meals uh, because I take some of my carbs from my meal one and put them on meal six just so I can have six meals. Um, or today I might actually just have five. I'm quite busy today. I might just have five meals today because I've got a dinner today. I've got a full day of prep, dinner tonight. Uh, I'm going to be late home, so I might just have five and just stick with the carbohydrates in meal two it is. Um, but 
I'll show you. We'll go along. I'll make up my decision. Also with Mill One, um, Lantus as well. Util utilizing that, used it in my off seasons before, so it's it's not something I don't know, you know, much about and how it works with me. So we're keeping that in um, on training days, non training days, every single morning with my first meal. Lantus goes in just to help push those carbohydrates through and push them into the muscle. Um, so that's meal one. Going to get this down now. We'll see you for meal two. So I have just finished meal number two. Yes, I forgot to film it. Of course, I'm busy, so I completely forgot I was doing a full day of eating, to be honest. Um, <clears throat> so I've got the plates here anyway, empty bowls and stuff. So pretty much just had, I just took a picture on um, Instagram, put it on the story. So I'll put that on, uh, show you what I had. Basically one bagel, 150 grams of egg whites, uh, two hex sausage, spinach, tomatoes, mushrooms, uh, one whole egg, um, two hex sausage, I don't know if I said that, and then just had 100 grams of oats, 23 grams of jam, 21 grams of raisins, cinnamon, um, and black coffee. So that is um, meal number two down the hatch um, and I'm, I will do five meals today um, so three meals to go um, scheduled at probably half two about four and then probably about eight um, as I like to like I said I've got a dinner tonight so I'll just have the meal in the car after, after the dinner and then drive home so that's the plan um, got more prep to do now, and then we'll see you for the next meal. Um, and yeah, pretty standard today. Um, I think it's just gonna be short, short and sweet. Um, tell you what I'm having for meals, and, and that's that. As long as I get all the meals in, I'm happy with a full day. Being it's not a you know cinematic thing. I'm just documenting. Apologies about the lighting. I'm in the car. Um, stopped for meal number four going in right now. Gonna get this down pretty quickly. So spaghetti and beef, bit of passata in there. Nothing crazy, basic bodybuilding meals. Um, got about 170 grams of dry spaghetti, um, 150 grams of beef mince. And then like I said, just some passata as well. Easy meal to get down. Um, little tip, if you are kind of in your like peak off season, I'm not yet, but if you are, um, there's a little trick. If you're kind of getting sick and tired of eating rice, pasta is the go-to if your carbs are high. Um, easier to get down, um, denser as well, so you can have a good, this has got about 100, 116 gram of carbs from this pasta and it's, you know, probably th half to three quarters the amount of volume that you get for rice um, so if your meals are pretty much consistently rice based add in a pasta meal between them just easier to get down just makes the rice meals go down even better you know before and after your pasta meal so i'm gonna get this down um this is meal four it's about 20 past five and then my last meal we'll see you for that so back for our final meal of this full day of eating. It's currently nine o'clock, so very much ready for my last meal. Uh, so this is meal number five. Apologies for this full day of eating. Not one of my best uh, full days of eating videos, but you did get to see every meal pretty much, bar one, I think, but I spoke about it. Um, so I will be coming with a better full day of eating. Today's just been a bit mad, a bit hectic um, on the road. Um, I'm currently in Congleton. Manchester ways um, just finished one of my fine dining dinners taster menu uh, which went well um, a full vegan as well so not that exciting but it's good ready for this meal now so we've got you can see pretty much what it is rice based um, 150 grams dry weight rice which is about 450 cooked weight 
um, jasmine rice, 250 grams of chicken, raw weight, um, 11 grams of peanut butter, some ketchup, some garden peas, and that'll wrap it up for today. Um, always with my first and final meal, I take um, Digest by Chain by JP. This has actually really helped. Um, I've been using this, that product now for, since I came off stage, so, um, about three months and it's, it's made a massive difference I think I'm comparing it to my last off season when food was like this high in terms of digestion I'm going through food like nothing um, not getting any sort of digestive discomfort no bloating at the end of the day even after you know 700 gram of carbs zero bloat um, and meals just go through really really well so that will wrap us up for today like I said, I will come back with a better full day of eating. So I apologize about this bomb, but it is what it is. Uh, I'm just documenting the journey and where we are right now. So next video on this series um, will be next week as usual. Um, definitely will be like a training video uh, footage one. I might do legs potentially. So we'll see you there for next week. Hope you enjoy today's See you again soon. Thanks, guys.